Wake up! You bloody sleepy thing. sitting here for three hours I think it's three hours yeah, it is. and we have officially found the laziest lioness in the world the animals walk past the at two meters of distance and then they only see her and she just sits and looks at them she looks she looks interested but she doesn't actually want to do anything the other ones over there which we can't really get to because they're in the middle of the marsh they keep chasing stuff around this one just sits and looks Go, Leah Lion. That baby's alone. Go now. Get it. It's right there. Get it. Oh, so ridiculous. So we're on our way to Third Bridge. We just left Pini Lagoon, which was a very good uh, spot for for Indian animals. The road is so different from how it actually looks in that area because it's so grassy and marshy there where. But around here, as you can see, is mostly barren and dead trees. Two broken tusks. Yeah. Hey, this is the guy. Look at the size of the sausage thing fruit things on the sausage tree. If this falls on you, you'd be dead. It weighs what six, seven kilo? Oh there's a plane. Oh, drop foot. Yeah. You hear that? We decided to stop for a spot of lunch. Second lunch actually is in the morning. So we'll do that, and then we'll be off again. What's for lunch? Bush hot dog. <laughs> Use a wrap, because you can't get fresh rolls. Got himself a bit of an identity crisis, I think. It's a ground hornbill in a tree. I wonder where the other one is. Yeah. This guy's pair for life, they're monogamous. Oh, baby. Just like us. Ugh. Nice, hello. Mm, very nice contact. I don't know if anyone stayed here in a while though. I can't even see a fire here. This is exclusive operator. It's uh, more of a wild camp than the other big camps are. And it's in the middle of quite a nice area. It looks quite desolate. So I don't know if it's a, in operation anymore. If you could stay here, yeah, this is definitely one to choose over a third bridge, which is quite full and busy. All right, let's go see if we can find that bloody leopard for a change. That was very cool to see after a leopard 
sighting. The honey badger is actually my favourite sighting. They actually some of the toughest creatures in the animal kingdom. They often take on lions um, and win the fight, chase the lions off. They eat snakes, poisonous snakes. They are extremely, extremely cunning. Um, in Afrikaans, there's uh, the saying tough as nails is actually Sotaisu Sarato, which means as tough as a honey badger. Which is probably why the military named one of their most successful vehicles in history after a honey badger called the Rato. They've gone off the kind of into the bush now, so we're gonna leave and try and find that leopard. <laughs> Like, there's the line, buddy. Step over it, see what happens. Right there. Right here's the line. Right here. This line. Right here. <laughs> right here. <laughs> Just in case you couldn't see it, I'll show you again. Right here. Tonight we're making a bonfire, nice and big, just got back, still no leopard. Honey badgers, yes, but no leopard. Um, apparently the animals visit camp quite regularly around here. So big, big fire tonight while we're still out. Uh, we're going to have some prawn stir fry tonight, something different a bit, I'm so sick of red meat on the fire now it's been two weeks of red meat on the fire every day so it'll be a good break go next, next time on crikey africa. africa we get a visitor in camp an over friendly one and we get badly stuck tell them what happened like seriously badly stuck <laughs> Got a fire there.